Hey guys, I'm Jay Parr here again with another video. Uh, sorry that it's been a long time since I've done a video, but don't worry. I'm gonna get back into doing these videos, but I'm very frustrating because I tried to film this video four times, or five, but today I'm gonna be showing you everything I picked up for the month of September on Blu-ray. So, let's get into this video. So, uh, first thing I picked up over the month of September is Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. This is the sequel to Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse, and this is the second one. But I did see it in theaters, and it was pretty good. It says, the best Spider-Man film ever made, over 90 minutes of extras. Easter eggs, delete scenes, and more. So the cover looks just like the movie poster, but you can see there's Gwen, there's me, you know me, Miles Morales, Spider Woman on a motorcycle, ooh. Then there's Miguel, 2099. Um, then there's Peter, what is he wearing? Oh, he's kind of baby right there. Okay, so, uh, that was. Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. So, there's that. Um, then I got Bo's Afraid, starring Joaquin Phoenix. Uh, never seen this in theaters, but someone told me that it was not a good movie. But maybe I'll try to watch it today, but I don't know if it'll be good or not. But, ooh, it's from the director of Hereditary and Mitzmar, a masterwork. Ooh. So that was that. I was afraid. Um, then I got Asteroid City. Saw it in theaters as well as Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. Uh, this movie stars a whole lot of actors. We have Jason Schwartzman, Scarlett Johansson, uh, Tom Hanks, there's Edward Norton, uh, Stephen Hark, Maya Hawk, Steve Carell, Matt Dillon, uh, Margot Robbie, Jake Ryan, Jeff Goldblum. It's an American emperor picture by Wes Anderson. It's a movie by Wes Anderson. And maybe I'll watch it again today. But it's just really good. But if you have not seen this, watch it. It is really good. But that was that. But ooh, back, we got some scenes from the movie. Wes Anderson's best movie ever. Bonus Futures. Whoa, cool. The Making of Asteroid City, Desert Town, Pop 87, Doomsday Carnival. Mochi and the ranch hands and the players. So that was that. Um. Then I have, ooh, I have Evil Dead Rise. Uh, this is a movie from Warner Bros. It's the original classic. Haven't seen it in theaters, but it's kind of scary because it looks scary, but. Maybe I'll watch it, but I don't know, but, uh, ooh, so, back, ooh, mommy loves you to death, these scenes look pretty scary, ooh, chainsaw, uh, a twisted tale of two estrogen sisters whose reunion is cut short by the rise of flesh, possessing demons, thrusting them into a primal battle for survival, as they face the most nightmarish version of family in general. I'll try to, so I'll probably be watching that. But, that's that. Um, then, I have, then I got The Flash. Another movie from Warner Bros. But, haven't seen this. But, I'll try to watch it. And... Ooh, it's got Batman and Superman. 
Well, this movie stars Michael Keaton. Um, heck. Worlds Clay, Special Features, and The Flash uses his superpowers to travel back in time individually, altering the future, but will making the ultimate sacrifice be enough to reset the universe? So there's that. Um, then I got Fast X. It's the Clutch's edition. Ooh, the cover looks pretty good. It's really shiny. And ooh, this movie stars Vin Diesel. So, ooh, this is a sequel to all the Fast and Furious movies. And I haven't watched it, but I'll try to watch it today. So, that was Fast X. Um, then, I, then I picked up The Little Mermaid, the live action. And they did the original Little Mermaid. And now, this is the remake of The Little Mermaid. Ooh, the cover looks pretty good. We have King Triton, or Ursula. There's Sebastian, right there. Ooh. So, uh, that was Little Mermaid, but if you haven't seen it, you should watch it. So, that's The Little Mermaid. Saw that in theaters, too. Then, I got... Then I picked up Disney's new film, Elemental. Uh, this movie is pretty good. Sun in theaters was pretty good. The cover, shiny. So you see there's Ember. Then there's Wade. Ooh, there's Olive Element City. Cool. Ooh, it also includes a Disney short, Carl's Date. Futures and deleted scenes. Cool. So, pack. Ooh, ooh, scenes from the movie. Spurns bright with Pixar's signature blend of vibrant, revolutionary animation. That was elemental. Um, then I have Ruby Gelman, Teenage Kraken. The new DreamWorks animated film. Uh, saw that in theaters too, and it was actually good. But I've watched this movie a lot of times at home, but I might want to watch it again. But the cover looks pretty good. It's from the studio that brought you Shrek and How to Train Your Dragon. Ooh, collector's edition. Ooh. Cover is pretty good, but uh, movie. So there's Chelsea. She was the evil sea witch. There's Ruby. There's her pet dog. There's her brother and her mom and dad. Cool, but back. Oh, some scenes from the movie. So that's that. Um, then I picked up Book Club, the next chapter. Uh, I got this on the last day of September, and this was from, I picked this up at Walmart. And, ooh, this is like the sequel to the first one. And it stars Diane Keaton, Jane Fonda, Candace Bergen, and Mary Steenberger. Wow, cool. And, ooh, some good scenes. Bonus features, book club back in season, still a stylist, and the woman in Italy. So, I'll try to watch it, but I haven't done a video on that. Um, then, the last scene that I picked up is No Hard Feelings, starring Jennifer Lawrence. Uh, it's rated R, and... Pretty awkward, and 
this uh, comedy film, but this is a movie that my dad really wanted to watch, but maybe me and dad, my dad will try to, will probably be watching it, um, so that was No Hard Feelings, uh, it has a heart as big as its laughs and special features, but that was that. Okay, so that's everything I picked up over the month of September on Blu-ray, digital. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll get back into doing videos, so make sure you look out for them. But if I haven't done any, then it means that I haven't done any and I quit. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And see you guys later. Bye.